I know Jody Mandel, who's at Children's Hospital of Philadelphia, did an informal analysis on some data that she had, and unfortunately never published this, but she was looking at sleep data she'd collected over years in children and just seeing if there was any pattern of these periods of nighttime awakenings. And in a nutshell, there didn't seem to be any predictability to these patterns of disruption or growth. It seemed to be very individual in child per child. So there isn't a lot of evidence that these are predictable things. That being said, I would say to a parent, if they're like, oh, my kid's sleep is good, now it's not good, what can I do? Have you changed something in your behavior around sleep? Have you started laying down with your child till they fall asleep when they used to have them fall asleep independently? Has bedtime slipped a little bit? Like the things that got you to success, often you need to revisit them when things start to go sideways on you. 